Hey guys and welcome back to the harsh and unforgiving world of Post for Nem, where for the past couple of episodes we've been going around making villages and getting everyone to feel pretty happy and recognising that there are quest options on the go. So I thought today we might do something about those quest options, maybe try and advance the Japanese culture over there beyond the wood age that they appear to be in. I also have a few other things on the list of uh, to do for today. This includes increasing the reactor size, uh, also trying to get the pink slime working well, uh, maybe go around and try and figure out where some of these uh, zombies are hiding out and maybe deal with that as well. But I'm going to go around and do a little bit of gas cleaning first, try and find some people to do some quests for, and I will see you back in a second. Oh guys, I don't, I don't know what I've wandered into here. I noticed that the Mayans had built a new building all the way over here. And look, look, they, it tells us where all the people are. Uh, do any of them mention that they've got a quest on the go? That that would be useful. Uh, gold harvest, gold something. Now, is this just what they are enacting? Yeah, look, chatting. Okay, that's, that's okay. Reserved for villager 48. I don't think this is going to help us, but I just wanted to show you guys that this was a thing. So one of these guys has a quest for us. Hi, hi, dude. How's it going? No, you don't want to talk to us. Okay, come on out. Look, look, there's a load of spam going on down there. But can one of you come out? Hey, that's good. Now, I want to actually talk to you. Uh, there appears to be a little bit of uh, entity lag on the go at the moment. Everything seems to be heading all right and then just suddenly not. Let's uh, have a quick chat to this. Nope. No, he's gone. Okay, so the other guy was too busy doing his Enderman impression, so I thought I'd come over and chat to this guy. Hi, you need to be at least favourite trader in this village to hire this. Uh, I'm not looking to hire, I'm looking to... Oh, oh well, that's a, a little inconvenient. Um, I was kind of hoping that he could give us a quest. What about you? Do you have one? No, you don't have one. So after repeated glitch troubles and snubbing by the mines, I've decided that I'm actually going to come and help out the Japanese over here. Now the first trick is to try and find someone with a quest on the go. I'm not sure where that person would be. Hi, do any of you guys have any quests on the go? No, not round here. This is of course the hardest bit. Hey, Fishing Frenzy, how are you doing there? Hi there, my name is Renzo Ono. Hey, hey, we know you. I've, I've done some work with you before. I don't know if I'll be able to meet my quota for today. Uh, do you think you could help me? Okay, we'll do that. Thank you. Four raw fish should be enough. Return them to my wife. Okay, so once again, four raw fish. Is there anyone else we can do? Now, th she's the fishing frenzy uh, quest delivery person. Has anyone else got any quests on the go? You don't have a quest on the go. Be nice just to find another one because doing one quest at a time is a little bit inefficient. I suppose we can do it though. I suppose so. Okay, so I've got four raw fish from the freezer. I should find Mrs. Onzu somewhere. I can't remember what the female honorary title is in Japanese, so we're just going to have to go with Mrs. You have got a weird suit on. Like, let's uh, let's try and crash down here. Do you reckon we can wake her up, or is she going to be like, no, I'm I'm sleeping. Hey, 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 no, you're sleeping. Okay, let's go get to bed. Okay, one small sleep later. Hopefully everyone is up and doing stuff. Fishing frenzy, hey. Ah, you must be the traveler Ren Renzo Onzo told me about. Have I caught the fish? I have. Wonderful, these are fine looking fish. The rest of the village shall be thankful as well. I've earned some reputation and some experience. So where does my reputation show up? So cu Japanese culture, that's all good. Can we um, see anything in here? Let me have a, a little bit of a, a search through. No, nothing in there. I did find, like, the G key was nothing. Of course, that was just my glider. Like this, it kind of didn't help much, though. Yeah, not even a list of reputations at the end of the map. Okay, let's go see what we can sell to these guys. To Oh, look, we've got a new quest over here. Hi, how are you doing? Can you help me, Twitchy? I'm missing my friends and family in the capital. We always enjoyed writing poems and letters to each other. I hope from the day... I hope for the day when we can write to each other. When the day comes, I would be like to be prepared. Could you gather some bits and pieces for me? Two ink sacks, four roses, two dandelions. Sorry, two ink sacks, two roses, two dandelions, and some paper. 
Uh, I will take that quest, thank you. Okay, let's go and get that. Now, this is also something that I just happen to have down in the crop section here. Now, obviously, paper is a little bit of an issue, but the two dandelion, the two roses, the ink sacks... Now that might be a bit more of a problem. Let's go see if we can get some from up top. I may have some in my chest over here. Yeah, so I do. How many was it? I can't remember. I'm going to take 10. That, that may be it. That's probably super overkill. And I believe it was only four or five bits of paper. Okay, writing poems. She'll be right with me soon. Did, did it go? Has it not gone? Go on, let, let, me, uh, let me talk to you, please. I am too tired. Oh, what? Okay, so we're going to have to wait. Let's uh, see what these guys have for sale here. What are they What are they waiting on? Let's have a look. They want some oak wood and some spruce wood. You know what? I can help them with both oak and spruce. Okay, so we should be able to do this one. No, still too tired. Hey, who, who's coming to sell stuff to me? So, someone should be coming up. Oh, wow. All the way from over there. Uh, this one has also teleported in front of me. There is a lot of teleportation going along with these guys. So they can uh, buy some of these, can they? We buy oak wood. Nice. Let's, let's take all of those. Can I shift click? I can shift click. What about these? We can shift click this as well. That's given us loads of dinar. Has this helped their problem here? It has indeed. So they should be off someone somewhere should be building a new place still resting okay we'll leave you to that let's try and find oh look some xp over here let's try and find the new building they're gonna build shall we let's uh teleport up no or not teleport twice maybe that should give us enough Guy disabled, active disabled. No, it's it's not being too kind here. When I spot it, I'll bring it back. So, here they are. This is where they're building over this way. Uh, so, it must have been an upgrade rather than an actual building. Because this one was here beforehand, was it not? Uh, also, a little bit short on the liquids. But I am glad that I got to help out here. Still waiting on that person to stop being so tired so I can give them their, their stuff back. Poets, hey? Poets. Uh, I say stuff back. Give them the stuff they wanted for the books. So are you going to... You gonna talk to me yet? You're still too tired. Um, I'm just gonna stand here and wait, guys. I'm just gonna stand here and wait. Well, it took forever, and for some reason I am now overheating, but I am gonna accept this quest. Graciously, she gives us everything that we want. Uh, 512 dinar, 256 reputation, and 8 experience. I got experience? It doesn't seem to want to actually give it to me, though. Just kind of follows me around in a funny manner. Let's get under here. Maybe we can pick it up from underground. I don't know where all that experience is. But right, has our standing... No. How, how do we put our standing up? Oh, look, here's another one of these creepy where is everybody rooms. Oh, man, these are... I don't know. I suppose they're nice, but they, they just feel really, really creepy. Yeah, we have a sign for every villager, and it tells you where they all are. Ooh. Uh, so this is... Man, he's a, he's a long way southeast of the, of the village. But everything, yeah, no, nothing in here shows any quests as I had uh, discovered last time. Maybe bedtime is the best time to go around and see if anyone's got any quests because, like, they're all found in their houses now. Let's go and check the person that I know has a quest for us, the fishing frenzy person. Uh, let's do a small spin with the... Yeah, so even when they're sleeping, they display their quest. So let's go around and see if there's anybody else quickly. We can also do a total tour of the village. So no, nobody here has a quest for us. We've got a mining shack here. Nobody's got a quest for us here. Uh, over this way. Hi, guys. I just thought I'd teleport straight into your house. I hope you don't mind. As I have a massive lag spike. Back here, we've, have we got a person? There should be a miner in here somewhere. I don't see them okay we'll just have to live with that over this way there should be another group of people hey why are you sleeping outside why would you sleep outside this is another group yeah i think we've covered all the all the quest givers here which is a little bit annoying because i really really wanted to put up my standing with them all right let's go over to the mayans and see if they will actually deal with me now Look, you can tell something's wrong. There's a there's a person just kind of hanging around outside here. Hey, what's are you real? Are you real? All right, I'm gonna sleep next to them, keep them safe. 
Should have located some quest givers before I slept. Oh, look, she didn't take any of the, the rose and stuff off of me. That's a bit weird. I was sure that was what she wanted. Okay, frustrated lumberman. Hey, man, come come here. Don't be so uh, frustrated. This axe is useless. Why no Mayan artisan capable of making a really good axe? It would be so much more productive with a decent tools. You do not have good the goods needed. Well, what do you want? An axe? An axe of some description? Uh, I don't know. Let's go make us... Mayans, right? Do you reckon they do stone axes? Or is that is that racist? Uh, I don't know. Let's let's go find out. Uh, let's turn the glider off as well. Someone's having a laugh at this guy's expense, aren't they? Let's let's break that out of the way. Don't want to do that. Uh, have you got anything in your chest worth? Ooh, look. I'm not going to uh, mess around with that though. Still looking for the guy. Where is the frustrated lumberjack? They're around there. There they are. There they are. Let's try and get inside and have a quick chat with them. I'd like to put my sword away if possible. I'm not going to let you pass. You do not have the goods needed. So maybe we do need the, the stone one. Maybe, maybe I wasn't just being funny. Okay, so I've come back with a stone axe. Maybe this is good enough. Maybe not. Uh, I would have thought he would have been right here. I bet he's gone delivering his goods, hasn't he? That is massively inconvenient. Uh, let's just have a quick look around to make sure he's not here. Okay, so where would he go to deliver? We would imagine him to follow this way down, maybe this bit of pathing. Uh, you're missing a friend. Hey, hold up a sec. A friend of mine named Akan Kachok uh, usually visits me at the same time every day. The strange thing is he hasn't been back been by today at all. He's several hours late. In fact, I admit I'm a little worried. Uh, spends a lot of time over by the mine. I'm sure you know how dangerous it is there. If you happen to be going that way, will you keep an eye out? Of course I will. Uh, okay, it also wants me to hire him, but that's, that's not what I want to do. No frustrated lumberman. Now, the thing is, which mine is the mine? That's strange reports over there. Um, hello, hello. Are you a guy? Like, this is a mine. We know this is a mine. Um, I'm so glad you found me. There he is, over there. Do you reckon that's the guy? It looks like it might be the one. Uh, I'm going to just glide my way around here. Excuse me. Uh, a spider bit me very bad while I was exploring the cave very close to here. I'm sure I've been seriously poisoned. You can help me. Please tell my wife... Com... Com... com uh, sorry. Co... Com... Chat... 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 Yep, there we go. She'll be able to help me. Okay. Hurry, I'm so dizzy. You. Vitally. Excuse me. I need I need you to look over that way. Says you're harvesting the maize. I look, can I can I talk to you? You're not really here, are you? You are not a real person. Okay, normally when they go off the chat excuse me? Normally when they go off the chat, they go and chat over this way. So let's see if we can spot like a body double of her somewhere. Um, I can't really remember anything other than her last name. No. Okay. Wait, are you a person? No. No. All right. Give me a second to walk, look around. Well, I found our frustrated lumberman in a, another lumber place over here. Hey, how's it going, dude? Uh, do not have the... You, you're going to want to want a diamond axe, aren't you? You're going to want a diamond axe. All right, let's go do that then. Ah, what do you want from me? So he doesn't even want the, the diamond axe. So I, do, I don't know what he wants. I don't know what he wants. Hey, how are you doing? You can't help us. Let's go have a look at that woman again. If all else fails, I might have to do a reload, which will be interesting. Yeah, look, she's just kind of stuck up there. It says she's off to chat and the antidote and stuff, but it's really not happening. So I log back, logged out and back in. She's not here. So she's got to be around somewhere, right? Here she is. Hey, there we go. We're looking, lacking two mushroom, two mushroom. I need two brown mushrooms and two red mushrooms and some squid ink. These are all things I actually have access to in the science room, I think. Two mushrooms. Ah, oh, it'll be down in the, uh, in the refrigerator really wouldn't it so i've already got some squid ink on me from already from other random quests and i've got two of each mushroom okay this is pretty good that could have been horrendous really is there a way up easier there is here and then we just kind of teleport out the wall here now where are we going to find her she's going to be back somewhere around here maybe last time we saw she was just here so maybe she's gone back home uh, maybe not. Is that her? What she was, she was wearing red, wasn't she? She was wearing red, so she's not there either. 
Oh, she's just kind of chilling out here at the moment. There's no time to lose. Save my husband. I know that the antidote should help with the poison. It requires some ingredients. Uh, all of those. Brilliant. We've been given a water bucket. Okay. Okay, that, that's cool. We've been given a water bucket. Let's go back and see if we can save matey's life we yeah we've definitely had the stuff taken off us it's not something we're expected to go uh and make ourselves hey come come on get back here matt no come on just i need to talk to you proceed with quest okay uh you knew that would help he drinks the antidote i'm always getting into trouble uh she always manages to help and we got a whole load of money and experience and denari has this helped my standing probably not Oh, it never helps. Never helps. All right, well, let's go do some technology. So I have in my hand an empty syringe, a golden carrot, and a safari net. Now, the safari net is the one with the pink slime in it, and if I combine these empty, well, this empty syringe and one of these golden carrots, I get a growth syringe, and I'm hoping it is just as simple as popping this down and hitting this. Is it not that one? I thought it was just a right click. Um, do I want to punch it? I didn't want to punch it. Oh, no. What would make you think that I'm the type of person who would read the wrong uh, recipe for the syringe? Of course, it's not the growth hormone we want. It's the uh, syringe of slime in beginning. So we put those down like that and that one there. Uh, hopefully, we should just be able to run through these. Paradise Farms had made, my, had made me another pink slime bucket. So let's go and find a suitable place to go and spill this on the floor. Obviously water flow is an issue with it so if we can put it in somewhere that would be much much nicer let's try down the bottom here yeah i mean we're gonna flood a whole load of stuff actually back there back there looks like the place to do it the mines won't mind if i uh, spawn a small pink slime here look there we go small small turn like that hopefully after a few seconds this will spawn it does take a little while sometimes i have noticed this uh sometimes it's a little better when it's undercover but we'll just wait we'll just wait okay that took a little while uh let's hit him with one hit him with a second now we we'll grab him we could have hit him with the third in fact let's do it let's pop him back down and we're gonna hit him with the third and he explodes into two small ones again uh so we're gonna capture one of those Oh, yeah, that's nice. This guy can just kind of run around and be free. I wonder if he'll despawn. I wonder if he'll despawn. If you come with me, actually, dude, uh, we could possibly get another one made, couldn't we? Oh, then we could capture a full-size one. Uh, this was a little failed experiment. I was just seeing if I could capture some stuff in the top here. Uh, in fact, maybe we can get this guy. Maybe if we can get this guy. Uh, I don't have a portable crafting bench on me. What an oversight. Okay, made myself another syringe quick. Let's... Put him big, let him loose, grab this one. Now, what do the medium ones give me on my death? Oh, they do drop slime balls. They do drop slime balls. And then lots of little ones. Ah! In fact, these ones are quite cute. We could just leave them around. Once again, these guys are not the type to do us any damage. Oh, no, no, no! Okay, final steps are relatively simple. We need to try and get rid of this guy with a oh did he go into there i hope not no no we picked him because i've set everything that's not a certain set of items to get voided from that pipe so uh, we don't really want that to happen wow frame rates was going through there but hopefully we can now put the grinder down and this should produce some more uh, mob essence we're going to take this guy do we want to replace the skeleton spawner with it or just add it to it as well um <clears throat> Actually, we're going to add it up there. We're going to put it up there. Well, this is a little awkward. Not only did they spawn before I got up there, but I've actually already done this little bit before. I just wanted to show you that the slimes were being spawned. They can also get through this little force field here, which is slightly annoying. It's not exactly what I was after. But coming down here, you can then grab a whole load of slime balls. It's going to be uh, nine of them in total and if we take them over to the kitchen i will come over here as i say i've already done all this because um well i went through all the steps and then i looked over to stop my recording and it turns out for some reason it hadn't started recording so i i was i was very sad about that guys as i'm sure you can tell but 
cooking this up, I am going to actually need more than one laser drill pre-charger. So I think we can do that and grab ourselves a pink slime crystal. Let's go upstairs and talk about how to actually make one of these bad boys. First off, we need to make this light here. That's nice and simple. Bit of glowstone, some quite clear glass and some iron. That's nice and simple. Uh, double layer capacitors, diamond, fused quartz and plastic sheeting. I forgot to grab the plastic sheeting, of course. But then all of this should combine together in into the laser drill pre-charger. Brilliant. So that's now two of them we've got, which is immensely good. If we come in and have a look at the quest, you can see that we have finished this laser to full, the laser drill pre-charger. We're going to get another one. That gives us three to hook up to our laser mine, which we'll talk about next episode, which will be all sorts of good. I don't know which focus to get. I need to go look this up online. Uh, but I'm going to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I will see you next time when we're going to get our infinite mining on with the amazing laser drill and probably a whole load of other stuff. I need to get my reactor bigger, but unfortunately I did run out of time in today's episode. But anyway, I'll see you then when we're going to do that. Bye!